morning, Grantsville Elementary. This is the Bulldog News for Wednesday, September 20th, 2017. My name is Jaden. And I'm Sarah. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today amongst the found, we have a frozen backpack, a camo hat, a pair of socks, a pink and black jacket, a green sweater. Please remember to put your name and initials in your school items so if they get lost, they can be returned to you. Bulldog events, Thursday, September 21st, will be a three hour early dismissal. Friday, September 22nd, third grade will be going to Hickory. Lunch today is chicken nuggets or Lunchable, tossed salad, applesauce, refried beans, and milk. Thursday's breakfast will be cereal, breakfast, breakfast, pizza, strawberry, applesauce, cup, grape juice, and milk. Wellness Wednesday, and now a healthy tip from our nurse. Good morning, and welcome to Wellness Wednesday. I bet a lot of you have heard this at home. Eat your breakfast. It's the most important meal of the day. Why are your parents always saying that, and why should you eat breakfast? Well, imagine you're a car. After a long night of sleeping, your fuel tank is empty. Breakfast is the fuel that gets you going so you can hit the road. Any breakfast is better than no breakfast, but try not to eat like donuts and pastries and things like that all the time because they're high in calories and sugar and fat, and they really don't contain the nutrients a kid needs uh, to grow. And if you have donut for breakfast, you won't feel full for long. Just like with other meals, try to eat a variety of foods, including fruits and vegetables and whole wheat grains, proteins, and dairy products. And when you eat dairy, we always uh, want to choose low fat or fat free, um, typically for breakfast. And we have this great opportunity here at Grantsville where we're able to have breakfast served in our rooms every day. Even if you eat breakfast at home, it's always okay if you choose something from the breakfast that's brought to your classroom each day, um, especially if it's fruit or yogurt or something like that. Cereal is always a good thing because you're, you're getting some milk with your cereal. Skipping breakfast because you sleep in too late or because you think it's you know, you don't want to eat that much in the morning, I'm just not ready. Maybe you wake up a little cranky in the morning and you're just not ready to eat. It, it doesn't help you um, maintain a healthy weight. In fact, people who skip breakfast tend to weigh a little bit more. If you're really rushed in the morning, try some quick breakfast uh, ideas, such as yogurt, fresh fruit, a banana, apple, something you can carry, whole grain muffin, uh, or uh, a toasted English muffin with some jam on it. Trail mix, things like that that you can carry that are easy. You can even eat those on the way to the bus stop. Um, just in case you need more convincing, there's evidence that suggests that eating breakfast is the way to go because kids who don't eat breakfast are less able to learn at school. They get less iron, which is an important nutrient in their diets, and are more likely to have a higher body mass index, which is a sign they may be overweight. On the other hand, the kids who eat breakfast do better in school, are more likely to participate in physical activities and tend to eat healthier overall. So tomorrow morning, don't run out the door on an empty stomach, fuel up with a healthy breakfast. And remember, part of being a top dog and bark, the B in barks is to be prepared. And that includes eating a breakfast, not just having all your materials, which is also very important, but eating a good breakfast in the morning. All right, that's it. I'll see you next week. Today's weather will be a high of 76 and a low of 59, with a 40% chance of precipitation. Sports news. 
come out to the Igloo and support NMS Volleyball's team for their first home game. Don't forget your don't forget to send your your sports scores to the morning newsroom. In 1904, the Wright brothers fly a circle in their flyer two. Happy birthday to Sarah Crane. Remember, if you announce your birthday on the morning news, please stop by the school store for your birthday pencil. How do baby birds learn to fly? They wing it. Tune in Thursday, Thursday for more Bulldog, Bulldog news. news. Bye. Bye.